Welcome back to The Time of Your Life. I'm your host, Ethel Rasmussen. The Maryland Senior Call Check Program offers peace of mind for those older adults who are living alone. With us today to share information about this exciting program is Rona Kramer, Secretary of the Maryland Department of Aging. Secretary Kramer, welcome to the show. Thank you. Lovely to be here. Before we begin discussing the Maryland Senior Call Check Program, can you discuss the Maryland Department of Aging's mission and goals? Thank you. Our job is to keep Maryland's older adults aging in the community, at home, where everybody wants to be. That's very true. Let's talk about Maryland Senior Call Check Program and the important service it provides to older adults in Maryland. Can you share information about the program and why it's so beneficial? The program provides a daily check-in call to anyone 65 and older that wants to have the peace of mind to know that someone is checking on them. We're hoping to prevent someone from languishing on the floor after a fall or a heart attack or a stroke without anyone knowing that they're there and that they need help. Can you tell us how the program works and if there's a cost involved? The older adult signs up with us and we'll tell you later how to do that. And we then ask questions about how to make this call convenient. Uh, we will schedule the call uh, at a time of day that is not disruptive. So if our member likes to sleep in, they can sleep in and we'll call them in the afternoon. And uh, the, then they will get a daily call. If they don't answer the call, then we will then call uh, someone whose name they have given us as a default and we'll call them and let them know that their friend or loved one has not answered the phone and that they should check on them. If someone doesn't have a, a default caller, it's fine. They should still sign up. And if they don't respond, then we call local law enforcement and they come in and do their regular welfare check. So we hope to save lives because sadly, we have had people pass away on the floor of their home with no one knowing that they were there. I know our viewers are wondering, is there a cost involved with this program? It is free. It is free of charge to all Maryland residents 65 and older. So anyone can participate? A absolutely. And we hope that people will participate uh, before they think it's necessary. Something that we have found with most of our programs, this one in particular, is that people always feel that they'll need it when they're older or they're okay now so they don't need it. The time to sign up is now before there's any indication that there might be a problem. Unfortunately, we don't get a heads up before a heart attack or a stroke or, or a fall or a bone break. So true. Secretary Kramer, can you share a little bit about the enrollment process and um, when the phone calls can begin? Very easy. Uh, you can sign up online and uh, we have the, um, the website and the address on for the web or if you don't have access, please feel free to call us. You can call toll free at 866-502-0560. And uh, we will be happy to get you a hard copy of the application and assist you in any way that you need to sign up. That's wonderful. Is there anything else that you would like to share about the Maryland Senior Call Check Program? It is one of our many innovations at the Department of Aging. We're the only state in the nation to be providing this service. And uh, so we hope that our residents will take advantage of that and our other programs, which can be uh, found on our website including a new durable medical equipment reuse program that we will be starting as well as a Communities for Life program. And that will provide non-medical supports to help people stay at home. These are exciting times for older adults in Maryland for sure. Thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to be with us today.
Thank you. Lovely to be here. We're going to take a short break, and when we return, learn about Baltimore County Department of Aging's annual regional resource directory called Community Resources 2020.